Hey, in this video, we're going to talk a little bit about how to import other people's N8N automations into your N8N. This could be useful if you're, for instance, if you join my community, I've got a number of those in there that you can download and upload. This could also be useful if you, there are actually thousands of free workflows out there that you can download. Or if you're moving from one N8N option to another, like let's say you were using the cloud version, but you want to transfer to your own local version, then you would need to download your N8N automations uh, in one server and transfer them to another. So I'm just gonna walk you through that process. It's relatively simple, but worth going over. So first let's go over what you would have to do if you wanted to transfer a automation from one account to another. All you would have to do is go to your automation in question. This is the summary plus document that I shared in my previous video. And just go up here to these, top, these little three dots up here, click on that and then select download. And what that'll do is it will download a JSON file, which you can then use to upload to your account. And all you have to do to do that is go back to your dashboard, select create workflow, uh, you'll have a blank workflow here. And then all you have to do is go up to those same three dots and select import from file. And then click on the thing that you downloaded and here it'll be all set up for you. Now, if you're downloading, say one of my automations, you will need to do a couple of uh, cleaning up uh, items here in this whole process. The number one thing will be making sure you have your credentials straight. So go to these Google Doc things and make sure your credentials are con um, properly connected. And this is something that I ex did a whole video about how to set up your Google credentials because it is not the easiest process. So go check that video out if you are, uh, are needing this. But that's the main thing you need to do is set up your credentials and then make sure like if we're downloading documents and files and stuff like that, that your IDs uh, for these doc IDs here are correctly pointing to one of your files and not one of mine, obviously. And then you would just save this, give it a name and you'd be done. But in addition to that, I would also want to highlight this page. This is n8n.io slash workflows. And this is a place where you can get, as they advertise here, over 7,000 workflow automation templates. You can search through them and just have fun with this. Um, you can go scroll down. They have like trending AI templates. You can browse by category, et cetera. And while this won't necessarily help you too much with writing, because as far as I know, there aren't that many book writers in here. I'm one of the only people doing this sort of thing for uh, creative writing. These can definitely give you a good idea of like what to uh, what to look at and uh, maybe give you some ideas of how people how people are doing certain things. Like for instance, this one, generate AI viral videos with Nano Banana and Veo3 shared on socials via Blotato. So it looks like you're gonna have ac uh, you're gonna need to have access to Nano Banana and Veo3 and Blotato to make this work. But if I wanted to look at this one, say I just wanted to maybe somehow use this and adapt it to create videos from my Summary Plus document that I mentioned in the last in the last video, uh, we click on this and it says use for free. There's a little bit of an explanation about how this works, some uh, ways to work on problem solving it if you have to. There's an explanation of what it does here. So this one collects an idea and image from Telegram, uh, which I uh, presumably you would put in there, enhances visuals with Nano Banana, com generates a complete video script with AI, creates the final video with Veo3, rewrites captions with GPT, saves metadata in Google Sheets, auto uploads the video to all major platforms via Blotato, uh, including TikTok, YouTube, Instagram, LinkedIn, Threads, Pinterest, X and Twitter, Blue Sky, Facebook, and notivates you on Telegram with a preview link once publishing is complete. Kind of a cool idea, right? It's definitely something that I could see myself playing around with at least. Um, so if you wanted to get your hands on this, you can go here to use for free. And there's a couple of things you can do here. Um, this is really meant for people who are using the N8N cloud option, which if you saw my video on the different options out there, that's not what I recommend. If you did have the cloud option, it should automatically detect your N8N running and you'd be able to just plop that into here a little bit easier. But since we don't have that, we're just gonna copy the template to the clipboard. And then what we're gonna do is create a JSON file. Uh, so all you have to do is really just go to Notepad if you're using Windows uh, or something similar. 
if you're using a Mac and then copy and paste that JSON into there. And then we're going to save as we'll just give it a name. Um, AI video automation one dot JSON. Okay. Then save that. And now if we go to our NNN instance here, we create a workflow, uh, select import from file, select the file, and you've now got that whole thing downloaded into your workflow. So all I would have to do now is make sure I've got it connected to all of the correct accounts like Telegram and Google and OpenAI and whatever else that they're using here. And I could just run this automation just like it shows us here. So it's pretty, pretty cool how this works. And you could definitely get lost just going through all of the different automations that they have officially here on N8N's uh, platform. So anyway, I hope this was a useful video for you. Kind of a quick one, but I thought that this would be a useful topic to cover before we start diving into more of the automations that I've created just so you can see how you could apply these to yourself. And once again, if you want to get your hands on these automations, the, the ones that I create, um, you can do so in the Story Hacker Gold program where we help mentor you through the whole process. So go ahead and check that out and I will see you in, in the next video.